Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Pisces. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your general love reading. I hope all has been well, Pisces. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves. Shout out to the beautiful soul family. Thank you all so much for your continuous love and support. It is always a pleasure to have you. Thank you so much, Pisces. Let's get into your general love reading. Let's see about the person here that's on your mind. Let's see what the connection here is with you two. And then we're going to pull out some tarot to see how this person feels about you and why. All right. What do we have for Pisces placements? What do we have coming in? Wow. We have wedding, Pisces. Oh, my goodness. This situation involves marriage. Well, look at there. This may be someone that you're connecting with. And in the future, you two have the potential to be married or have some type of commitment or maybe just putting a title on it. OK, some of y'all, you're definitely connecting with someone where there is definitely a possibility or an opportunity for a commitment here. Yeah, look at that. We got keep an open mind, Pisces. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. Wow. Yeah, some of y'all are definitely connecting with someone new here, okay? Wow, let's get some tarot out on this, Pisces. All right, let's see about this person here that is and could be the one, okay? Wow, Pisces, if the reading so far is resonating for you, don't forget to smash that like button. All right, and don't forget to adjust your notification bells when I do go live on this channel for live stream readings and also questions as well, all right? So let's see what we got here for you, Fish, as well. We got here the queen of, I'm sorry, hmm, I want to say the queen, so a queen could be significant, but I want to say empress here in reverse, all right? This could be a Taurus or a Libra here, some of y'all exchanging energies here with Pisces. Um, we also got the ace of pentacles in reverse. Some of you all, you're not wanting to accept this person's offer here, okay? This could be an earth sign or an air sign for some of you all, or you may not be in the space to be able to do so. Um, some of y'all, you know, I'm not sure what this may be. Someone may have lost a loved one um, or if you were carrying a child, okay? My apologies, my condolences to you and your family. All right, but we have an empress here that's off balance here. Um, not seeing the potential in this connection here for some of you all, not all of you all. And then we got the three of pentacles, Taurus, Capricorn, again, Virgo energy here. But you also got other individuals or another situation where someone actually wants to collaborate with you. Some of y'all, there could be something going on within your working environment. There could have been a third party going on here. Okay, let's see what is going on. Let's clarify the Empress in reverse. Let's see, why do we have the Empress here in reverse for Pisces? Let me adjust the screen so you all can see the cards, okay? Let's see, what is going on here for the fishes? Why do we have the Empress in reverse? Why is the Empress here in reverse? Spirit team, Lord and angels. We have here the King of Cups. Yeah, some of y'all, this could have been a masculine energy of yours, or this could have been the father of your child or the mother of your child. Take how it resonates with you. This could be someone that you were definitely connecting here with, or you definitely got feelings for this person. We got the Herman card, Virgo energy here. Some of y'all, you had to disconnect from this person here. You felt like that this offer wasn't genuine, okay? This person put you in the space. It could have been unexpectedly what you may have found out about this person, but it definitely having you to go into hermit mode and kind of isolate yourself from this person and just individuals to figure out what's going on here and how you want to move forward and work with others. Let's clarify the three of pentacles here. Some of y'all, this person again could be an earth sign or that could be a water sign, okay? We got Pisces, Cancer energy here, Scorpio. Virgo energy, Capricorn, and Taurus, all right? Let's see what else. We got the high priestess. Look at you showing up in your reading. You know what's going to work for you. You know what's going to be the best opportunity for you. I do see you following your intuition here in the near future about this situation. I feel like because you maybe found out the truth or finding out how much feelings that you have for someone, you're now knowing how to work through this situation or doing what it is that you need to do. Clarify the high priestess. So some of y'all, you realize that this person that you are connecting with that's new, that this person um, has a high potential to be in a commitment with. Yeah, we got the uh, two, I'm sorry, this is, a, yeah, so two of ones here. 
So you've made a decision here and you're making the right decision, Pisces. I feel like some of y'all may be beating yourself up. You don't know if you're making the right decision or not here. Some of you could be indecisive about this could be a new job or a new opportunity that you're wanting to work towards or work with individuals here. This could be a new person that you're choosing to work with as far as connecting in a relationship with because we got pretty much things going on on the physical, financially. And then we also got things as far as romantically wise, whoever this person that you're connecting here with. Again, they could be a water sign. It could be a fire sign or an earth sign here. Okay, let's see what this person here wants to say, Pisces. Let's see what this person here wants to say. Wow, definitely if the reading here is resonating for you, Pisces, don't forget to smash that like button. All right, that'd be very much appreciated. All right, we have, I'm always watching. Wow, so you definitely got someone here that is observing and watching you, okay? We got, they can stand you. Wow. So whoever this person here is, okay? I feel like because you're connecting with someone new, I don't know if this is an ex here of yours or an ex of this person here that can't stand the fact that you are allowing someone to be happy and then someone is falling in love with you, okay? This could be your ex. This could be their that, their person's ex here. Yeah, we got gossip. So, baby, your mouth is obviously seeming to be in everybody's, your name, excuse me. I had that totally backwards. Your name is definitely in someone else's mouth. And it's not just one person here. We got they coming out here. We got gossip and we got the three of pinnacles. So, it's definitely telling me it's more than one person here, okay? But someone that wants to be with you, they don't want to put you in this situation again. And that's why I feel like maybe the person that they went back to, they don't want to be with that person no more and that person can't stand you now because this person wants to be with you and it's just a crazy mess here i feel like for some of you all as well here wow pisces let's see what the potential outcome here is going to be in the near future again definitely if the reading is resonating if you would like to book a personal reading pisces my email details are down below in the description box if you're new here and you would love to join my patreon family to get more readings definitely come and check me out on patreon all right all the details are in the description box and listed on the home page for the links that you can follow all right let's see what's the potential outcome let's see now what's going to be the overall outcome where is this going to go in the near future wow we have the seven of cups with you having options here the seven of cups talks about opportunities and options choices okay and it looked like some of you all are choosing love she has all these other choices that she can choose from, but she has to be mindful. With this lady's face expression, you want to be mindful what you choose here, okay? Don't get lost in tarot land, Pisces. You know how y'all can do, okay? But wow, Pisces, that is your energy check-in for today. Again, don't forget to like, subscribe. Shout out to my family, my soul tribe. I love you. I appreciate you. And I definitely look forward to your next energy Check in, Pisces. Be safe. Be mindful of your choices. Follow your intuition and use your discernment, Pisces. All right? I love you. Bye-bye.